Gemma and I sail Not Shore 1363. I've been sailing 11s for about five or six years. I started as a crew when I was about 10 or 12. My brother's been really helpful along the way with like, he's quite, he's a big role model towards me as well as my dad who sailed a lot when he was younger and the manly coach of course, Dolly. But yeah, being involved with it and the friends that you make from it really helps you go better if, as you become friends with most of the fleet. My name's Lucas Patrick and uh, my boat name's Firefly. <laughs> a long trip and, but it's been fun and we learning lots of things we need to improve on for next nationals. I like the reaches and I like the challenge every day and how much boats there are. I'm Zachary and I sail a boat called Firefly with my brother. It's fun because of how fast it is and it's a big step up from the last class we were in. I'm um, Ellen Murray and we sail Helter Skelter. And I'm Amelia Pilgrim. This is my third year. And this is my second year. Yeah, you, you've got to think about a lot more. Yeah, like considering if you learn in a single-handed boat, they're usually pretty easy, but you get to flying lemons and you've got more to consider. Mm -hmm. we're, we're, we like heavy we winds. Like heavy heavy winds, winds are good. Because we're one of the heavier crews. Yeah. I play cricket. I yeah. play netball as well. Sailing's way Sounds better. Sounds way better. Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, hi, I'm Hugh Stoddard. I've had two of my sons go through the Flying 11 class. My eldest is now sailing 29ers um, and the youngest one is finishing off his last regatta in Flying 11s here at these Gosford Nationals. And for us, the Flying 11 has been a really good class to develop their sailing. They get to sail two-person boat with their mates, enjoy it, pass on their knowledge to younger crews because they're a good boat that teaches good techniques, good boat handling, you know, they go fast, they have good reaches, so that's why we're here with the Flying 11s and why it's put them in a really good position to go on to whatever's next for them, whether it be an Olympic pathway or to go into the skiff classes and, you know, just have fun here locally with that, so. A lot of the top skiff sailors, pretty much all of them have been through Flying 11s and then there's also a lot of Olympians, so Nathan Outridge, um, Goobs, his crew, both of them went through Flying 11s, Malcolm Page, you know, people like Olivia Price even, I think, came through Flying 11s. There's a lot of female sailors as well, which, um, you know, it's a very equal class for that. We've had all female national champions, as well as a lot of mixed crews. So it's, it's just good. It's an all-comers fleet. It tolerates a lot of, you know, big weight range in the boats and you can still be competitive and everyone has a lot of fun, so they're good. <laughs>